Hola, Osla here from Simply Cuba Tools, and today I will be talking to you about what makes Havana the most photogenic city. I have to say the only reason I'm limiting this post to Havana today is because we'll be focusing on this amazing city this month. Uh, but to me, the whole of Cuba is a place where you just want to be capturing every moment. Okay, just feel like taking photos every single moment with every single thing inside. But let's look at Havana. What makes it photogenic? Well, I feel it's got everything from the pastel colored buildings, some with the added characteristics of the painting being half peeling or with exposed bricks or crumbling walls, adding an extra level of interest into it. There are also obviously the vibrant colored classic cars that you see around. There are amazing sunset. There are waves crashing up against the malecon. There are the street vendors, whether they bringing food around or whether they selling art or crafts. There are the live performers in the vibrant colored outfits or with their music instruments which of course also add to the excitement because you can dance a little while you're taking photos. There is the artists creating amazing paintings, there is wall art, some are fresh, vibrant and recent and some are a bit older from you know the revolution times left over. There are the majestic squares that you can see around with great statues, there are forts and of course the local people because they are what make Cuba beautiful. So what more can you really ask for? But realistically, how can you capture these moments? Needless to say that the first thing that you have to do is always have your camera on you or at least some sort of device to take pictures with. As part of our tour, our photo tour capture the essence of Cuba, we take you to spots that provide perfect photo opportunities or you can join various day tours around Havana. Having a guide means that you can not only find the best spots for photos, but also learn about the history and the culture behind the elements that you're capturing. Places like Revolution Squares, Moro Castle, Old Havana and its cathedrals, the Revolution Museum, the Capitolio, Hotel Nacional, Lanon Park, La Guardia are just some of the places that are a must-see. And there are of course the back streets, the cars and the people. So some of the tips that might help you take photos around Havana because let's face it, some of these that I have mentioned you've seen on other pictures as well. So visualize it in a different way. Visualize it from a personal view. Um, give it a context, some sort of a different perspective, different, use different vantage points or capture a different moment in time. Something that would tell your story, why you're finding the place amazing. And just remember, visiting Cuba is a once in a lifetime experience. So make sure that you take your time and you immerse yourself in the atmosphere and you actually breathe it in as you're taking the photos. If you wanted to have less people in your pictures, less tourists also, because or just less people, less tourists, uh, early mornings are a great way to uh, go on a walk and capture pictures with less people in them to avoid the crowds. And be patient, be receptive, feel what's coming at you, be attentive. And of course, respect the local people. Don't just go about and snapping their pictures left, right and center. So I mentioned that we do a photo tour and why should you consider going on a photo tour with us? So we use local guides so they can not only tell you the history behind the places that you're visiting but they may also have some unexpected insights, interesting stories to tell to go with your photo. They might actually be able to ignite that spark for you to find a different perspective in capturing an iconic place in Havana. We also group together areas of interest so we can maximize your time in capturing photos. We also explore on foot mostly to allow you the opportunity to take in the sights and to discover locations of the beaten path as well. We also help you um, visit each area like a local and we help you capture real people in portraits with, with their permission of course. And the guides can help you connect with the locals and even hear their stories, what they're about, what they're doing, how is their life, which also might help you 
savor the moment and connect with them on a deeper level before you start taking photographs. And we also ensure that we provide you with endless chances to photograph urban views, the architectural landmarks from various viewpoints, just to name a few. And one of the biggest advantages is that we don't just take you around in Havana, but we take you around half of Cuba on our tours. So consider it, see how you go. And next time when you're in Havana, make sure that you savor the moment, connect with the locals and take some amazing pictures to share. Speak to you soon.